Hi, this is Parish President Cynthia Lee Shang. I'm here at our fire training facility. With the newest addition to this facility, this is a train car prop that we were able to get donated to us. We're very excited about this. As you know, for first responders, the ability to be able to train with something as real world as this kind of prop um, only helps make them better when they have to respond to real emergencies. We're out here today uh, looking at the newest addition to the training center, or what we hope to be the new addition at the training center. This will be a load arm train car prop which will simulate exactly what's in the refineries across the parish and, and all out of our facilities. So what you see here today is the first of what we hope to be several expansions of the type of firefighting training props that we have here at the Jefferson Parish Fire Training Center. This is the rail cars. This is going to teach our firefighters just what they have to do when they're fighting a fire or a hazardous material event involving rail cars. I've been in the fire service at Jefferson Parish for over 40 years on the West Bank and every department on the West Bank a rail car passes through every day. This is going to be one of the greatest props that we've ever seen out here. Our firefighters will actually get hand-on experience handing something with a rail car. You don't really wake up every morning thinking I'm going to go have to deal with something with a train or a rail car or something like that. But when it comes up, we need to have that base training and that idea of how we're going to approach this. It can be very operationally challenged. This gives us a chance to do those type of practices, training, and, and maybe answer questions that we wouldn't want to have to answer that given day. I want to thank the people who helped get this train car prop to this facility. We had a lot of donations and a lot of people who believed in the importance of this project. What our goal is here is to show that if there's a leak, as on a hazmat side, they'll be able to patch a leak. They'll also be able to look, we are going to set it on fire, okay? And they will be able actually to fight the fire if there was a rail court disaster on any rails in Jefferson Parish. Firefighting is all about training and experience. You know, the first time you deal with something is not when you want to deal with it on a real scene. You want to do it here on a training scene. We hope to make this facility a real regional and state lure for industry to train their employees and for other parishes to train their firefighters here. And this is a big addition to helping us reach that goal. We hope that we can, we can draw some attention from more industry so we can generate some dollars out there with this new prop. We know it's what industry is looking for. It'll be a one of a kind in the state of Louisiana. The closest one is at Texas A&M over in Texas. In my fire protection district on 4th Street in Marrera, the railroad tracks are probably 30 feet from residential neighborhoods. I will go out there and tell them, because that's a scary thing. I will tell our people that the firefighters that work for the Marrera Harvey Fire Department and all the fire districts on the West Bank will have training in case we have a mishap with a rail car. We have rail lines running all throughout the East Bank and West Bank, so having all of our parish fire departments parish-wide have this training should give our citizens a level of comfort that should something happen, our firemen know what to do. We in the fire profession never really know where we're going to end up day to day, but this gives the citizens a chance to know because we've got rail tracks running through little communities and everywhere all around here and it gives the citizens a chance to know that we are trying our best to give them that great quality of life here in Jefferson Parish. When we pull up to that refinery, we'll pull up to that plant, we know what it's going to look like when that rail car is burning, so we'll have that first-hand experience. Mm -hmm.